Okay, everybody, I'm going to show you what digital asset investor does not understand. Very good point. Now, this is something that just has confused me. He's confused. Since this guy even popped up. Since Justin's son just popped up. He only popped up like 11, 12, 13 years ago. This Justin's son guy. He's now saying that there's going to be several celebrity candidates uh, who, who will be issuing tokens on the Tron network. Have these celebrities not learned anything? Who in their right mind would issue tokens on anything right now? Count. Tron's celebrity season will be even grander than the, than the Met Gala. Tell me about this. What, what are we talking about yeah. here? Yes. Um, first of all, I think for the name. And the other thing is, why is just, this goes, there, there's several of these guys. Here we go. Why is Justin Sun, Jed McCaleb, all these people that, that, that seem untouchable, they're, they're allowed to issue these tokens at will. Okay, why is Justin Sun, Jed McCaleb, I got it. Somebody show Digital Asset Investor this. <clears throat> Here's an article right here that I did only eight months ago. The Tron founder, which is Justin Sun, also mentioned the role he played in Ethereum's early development. So if we look here, I want you to see. Bitcoin's early development. Right there. There's the article there. I've already done all this. There's the show. If you want to find it for Crypto Hulk, go to the 12 second mark. Justin Sun didn't just pop up. So somebody needs to tell Digital Asset Asshat Investor. Justin Sun was there when Tron was around. When when was early Tron? 2014? 15? That'll make it like nine, ten years ago. Justin Sun did just not pop up. He actually worked for Ripple. Here's the illegal Ethereum sales. I wonder if Justin Sun was involved in. Next, here's Justin Sun. Justin leads Ripple Labs day-to-day -day business in the greater China. <clears throat> okay, he got a master's degree. Now, that's all interesting. Now, here's an article here. <clears throat> Vitalik Buterin. <clears throat> where you have Wang Zheng, the Chinese firm. Wang Zheng formed a relationship with Buterin. Now, this is all interesting. Wang Zheng blockchain had something called Blockchain Week. So the Chinese place that Vitalik's linked in with, and guess who's right there? Jed McCaleb, Jeremy, Jeremy Allaire, Vitalik Buterin, Justin Sun. He's been there from day one. So somebody like better tell him maybe you can help your old friend your old boy let him know Justin's been there from day one it's just internet the internet investor guy has no clue about any of this